hot and fresh for this one. So here's how it's going to work. All right, you guys are going to remove all of the options that you have, and you will pick just one. And okay. Four categories. So let's go for the first one. This is going to be Masters winners. But who is this? These names. Which one will you keep? Which two will you get rid of? Get rid of. Get, get rid of get rid just, of optic. Get rid of optic. Get is Tyson optic. and John? I just want to pick Fnatic. Gotta, uh, I get rid of two. Get rid yeah, of two. No, Listen, yeah, I mean, Fnatic. I could see them taking a trophy the next event. I would say this one, but. Um, we got a really scuffed Airbnb, and so Amin and I ended up sharing a bed. And I guess I'm I'm really used to just sleeping with Kaide. Uh, and so I'm I'm used <laughs> to sleeping next to Kaide. And I would say I'm quite a I'm quite a cuddle bug. So. <laughs> My God, there's no way this guy was cuddling John Cutie. <laughs> Oh, I think I wake up like three, four hours in, and I'm straight up just like cuddling a meme. And oh my god! In my brain, I'm like, what the fuck? And I like, as I become more and more, dude, there's no way. Wait, come like, wait, you guys think John Cutie cuddled him back? John Cutie was like, what's going on here? Like, what am I doing? And like, I like tried to slowly get off. It was wild. <laughs> wait, that's actually hilarious. Look at Kaide's reply to it. It's funny. It's actually hilarious. <laughs> I'm dead. I'm so dead. He's failed back. Yeah, Giacomo just turned around. He just turned on him. Like, it was just crazy. Always on those. I, think, so many good I think I got to go this with so, the, the Soul Cast failed knife. Because okay. it's just, it's the most historic. It was like the first yeah, yeah, moment. Zee. I remember like sitting at home with my friends watching and just like waking up early for that match and screaming when it happened. It has, it <laughs> has art's really good, happened. right? Although the jaw one is close too. That was also ridiculous. The jaw one being the two he's failed knife where jaw spun right? around and, and this is insane. turned on him in, in an instant. It was yeah. actually quite hilarious. But, all right, so we agreed on the desk here. You know, they would say the numbers are, are on the favor of Solkis with the failed knife. Sorry, buddy. We love you. He's uh, drawn me? Favorite. Wait, are they? All right, folks. Well, let's go ahead, though, and talk about our matchup. No more of the fun. You hear the music? It's done. All right. It's time to talk about That's the game cute. that we have in hand over here because we have some world champs that are going to be taking the stage in a moment. But here's a little That's interesting cute. tidbit is that Masters does not seem to fare that well, Mimi, for this powerhouse squad. Yeah, when they, they showed up to two Tokyo, 2-0 out of that one. They showed up to Copenhagen. 0-2 oh, out of that one. For, for some Where? reason, Loud tends to kind of have slow starts to the year when they come to these Masters tournaments. They performed really well at both champs after that. But there isn't... It, it's not unprecedented to see this team go down early, to see them lose. And I actually think it is interesting to draw comparison oh, this. to them losing in Masters Tokyo, because then I feel like there was a lot incomparable in terms of them kind of struggling to find their identity. That's when they were Your hair is too Oh my head. god, yeah, my they, hair they is hard to do. I don't really know what I do my hair myself. Like the best jet in the world. He played jet. Damn, it was actually that. a fire drawing, except this guy does not look like me. Once. Like, not at all. It was kind of similar to I don't think, here, at least. Where, where going also, where's my beard? I don't even have a beard. This is me, right? Position. Yeah, that guy's me, I the think. Is, is that me? Or is this guy? Who's this guy? Time to, to, to make it work here, where they failed in the past. That's gotta be Rob. Is that Sam? That's gotta be Sam, right? Yeah, this guy's definitely me. Maybe the ascent one needs a little bit Dude, this guy looks more like... But especially on Icebox, I think there's a ton of interesting ways... This looks like John Cutie with his hair slicked back. But, again, it's such a short turnaround and not being able to anti-strat. I wonder if that's gonna be... A, a downfall for them up against a squad of FBX. Look though, at Rob. Look at Rob. It might actually work for them. Look at Rob. Yeah, absolutely. I, I think that that Rob is Rob looking like Avatar. Right now. When they were playing in Americas, they were playing Phoenix and Breach. Oh, wait. I just realized maps. Charles they, in the they background. In the first matchup of Masters Madrid and they played... No, I just realized Charles in the back. They changed onto the Yoru on Ascent. And I, I think it is the right change, right? And, and yeah, Finesse is looking good. Is this overcooked? Is Loud going too far with the team? This person is uh, pretty talented, huh? Is yes. Right, they're trying to do something no one else has done. They're taking Damn, some time two jackets. To do it. It's not fully fleshed out compared to the old stuff Loud saw. Sure, but I'm not this against is pretty good, it. Yeah. I don't necessarily agree with that fully because I don't think it's the perfect meta composition. But I think what they're doing. Damn, this person is, is when good. This team is a squad that's like, like this is drawn or what? Is this, uh, this is drawn. What is this? A little bit more gimmicky, a little bit more off kilter. They tend to make that work. For me, seen some teams. I think the general narrative is being. Uh, look, there's so many details, fanatics, right? Positions. Maybe they're a little like, bit too predictable. Imagine drawing each part of that. Against, both from the, from the community, and I've heard it from and teams that they played against. Yeah. So this is one of the things where I, I don't mind if teams. Just, it's it's an good. idea that sometimes you get punished for, but I always respect teams for trying it. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of like peak paper X, where. Sauce is the only bald player to attend. 
and paper X comps. And I'm not really, I don't love on paper these okay. loud comps. What but is when that? you have a team that's fully committed behind it, can implement it well, you can be sure. successful. We can talk about Masters performances, but after playing on the international stage, doing so well at champs. Yeah. Uh, I saw this the other day. Or I was here, I didn't see it. At a video game, you're in the height of your prime in your career, you're young. Okay, I know what he's about to say. I know what he's about to say. And you take a fucking year off to stream. <laughs> you, there's just no dog in these kids no more, bro. I would have been fucking chopping this off guy is to get on brain dead. Good as some. This guy is brain dead. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Guys just. Oh, yeah, it gets funnier. It gets funnier. The prime years of his life, pissing it away to thank the chat for poggers and gifty subs. <laughs> And gifty thumbs, eh? He's kind of guilty too. At least this motherfucker won a major. What did Sam do? Oh, okay. I want a dream hack. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> fucking who gives a shit? You're watching this guy tens literally massacre the entire world right now in Madrid. What are you doing, Sam? You're watching him play. Does it? Would that just fucking eat you alive? How does that not kill you inside? <laughs> Who's gonna stop Zelsis? Don't want it anymore, bro. They really don't. Who's gonna stop Zelsis? That's what I'm saying, Sam. Like, all this is just, just so you know, is gas. I'm trying to motivate you. I just, I would have, I wished I could have been as good at you at the game that I love to play. And now you're just sitting here taking a fucking break to jerk off FNS in a Discord call and tell all the other teams that you're watching that they're shit. Like, you could be the fucking Grim Reaper of the entire world in Valorant and propel USA into dominant, unquestioned glory, but you'd rather sit it out so that you can... This guy's a professional so yapper for real, dude. 5 this guy is seriously a professional yapper. This guy's making some fanfiction or what? This guy's making fanfiction in his head. And now we're getting fucking slammed. Sam, get the fuck out of here with your participation. Fuck! <laughs> You He's literally an old man now. <laughs> they would understand a what little bit of it. And yeah. uh, uh, Benoya, I didn't, <laughs> I'd never seen that word before. So that caught me off guard. But the, what is the this? mountain, I thought, I, well, we wouldn't want to go to the mountains. That sounds like a wonderful. I mean, the beach sounds nice too. I mean, yeah. But that's that's what Sadik was saying. He was like, what the hell are you going to do on a mountain? But then you get sand in your, in your feet and it's coarse and it's literally. everywhere. All right, guys. <laughs> all right. So let's move on to Loud's opponent. Least in all game. On the other side of that stage. Now, they did get 2 0 by Carmine Core on day one, but I, but I think a lot of people like that one Mimi felt like FPX showed us some pretty solid individual skill. Like their one v ones, it felt as if they were taking confidence. All right, we're gonna lie. Which was pretty big for them in comparison to what we've seen in the past. Yeah, that's the thing. If nothing else, that FPX will never lack. I mean, life was insane on this game. Autumn was having his moments. Fan art. The players will frag out. But but I also felt in particular on the second map, they were showing us a little bit more depth. Nice. I thought compared to the first time we. We saw Berlin where he was like lurking every accurate, round on Faye and doing a lot of the omen cloak really troll stuff with Here the jersey was a under more sensibility in the way they were playing. They were still taking those risks. Taking oh, those ads are on. Moments. Okay, I'm gonna turn them but off. I sorry, they were actually they're on yesterday. Auto ads on that attack of Lotus, and it really showed that the that China is a region, and this team in particular has gained some more depth while still having those chaotic roots. Well, this is the thing, you know, I, Lotus was really what drew my eye as well, because looking at it, there were a couple rounds, round 15, round 19, if either one of those goes to FPX up against KC, this is oh. somewhere that they mic's quiet, I can fix that soon. I'm trying to turn bubbles on for you guys today. Let's see if I can do it. Only reason it's hard is because I have dual PC. B-roll? A lot of the teams uh, have had like a wake up call that you know, there's, you've actually got some real competition this year. Yeah, I think teams have to work a lot harder. It's all unforsaken. The utility two flashes will now no longer. I feel like we're not playing up to our performance yet, but I believe that we will overcome this. Oh. 
I really, really believe mm, that's not working yet. Hold on. Storm every upcoming game, and we're gonna become even stronger. It's our home crowd, and we're gonna show it. Heretics taking us the distance. It doesn't matter if you lose the first day. For me, it's just a warm up day. I think Paper X is playing really individually. I don't see a good team play on the Damn. team. Damn! So if we shoot heads, everything is gonna be fine. We lose to EDG. We're not gonna lose again. I think it's possible to look at other teams in the league. Yeah, it's possible. Let's look at our... Before that, we were very good at playing or something. We're going to play with us. Today,今天,今天之后不一样。我们依然会很自信的去面对下一场比赛，然后在这之中会很好的去复盘，然后去改善一切的问题。Uma <笑> 无论我们接下来遇到谁，我希望你们不要小瞧我们，我们会让你大吃一惊。Gamba, it will be wait. Gamba, is there a mod here? I can do Gamba. Hold on. We have the maps, right? Yeah, we do. What was the first map? Sunset or Lotus? Totally agree with them. Autumn really was impressive. We say goodbye to FPX, unfortunately, but you know they they fought their heart out there. Loud moves on in this competition, showing why they are a force to be reckoned with here on the international hey, stage. But Mimi, I was very impressed by what I saw, specifically, like Lawrence said, from Autumn. Yeah, map number one was a struggle, but map for two sure. for the team okay, was buddy. a lot more. Okay, Both buddy. Life and Autumn as individuals. I think our Gang Gang is not done with you yet. Coming home from Madrid, and as well as that, I think Carmine, Ar Carmine Corp. Implementing that Yoru comp very well. Kind of cool, kind of cool. I think this is really indicative uh, of the fact that the, the Chinese region, the new league, it just ki kicked off, but these teams are continuing to grow and expand and, and getting better and better each event they attend. Yeah, I mean, for Autumn, he was so involved in those early fights. My guy comes out of there with, what, seven out of nine opening duels going his way. Yeah. So Bottom left is Terry. So clutch situations as well, buying the way back through. I've really enjoyed watching this guy play, but well, we don't get to watch too much more of him. It's a, it's a a little bit sad, but I don't think that's so. ultimately how, the, how these tournaments work, how the stakes work here. But yeah. a lot to learn from for this squad now going home to apply to the regular season to try and bring into, because the next time we have a chance to see them internationally would be at home in Shanghai getting to represent China there. So definitely a great opportunity to improve and try and re-qualify for that event. Yeah, that would be awesome to see if whether or not they can make it there. And, and I think uh, indications definitely point in that direction, wouldn't you say, Mitch, with EDG being so strong. Yeah, I think so. Home field advantages as well if we do end up getting there you would be delighted proud Terex paid chatter storming away and as we can see yes it is indeed an edg timeout no it's yeah. a timeout I, I think it's almost just off the manner in which these rounds have been won as i said the first two rounds they got a only here kill. for the cloud w <laughs> shout out Terex stream all right that might be the first Terex sign i saw hey shout out to that guy hey shout out to that guy i didn't want to hey, say it but, but i haven't seen one that was the one you saw looking for it i'm looking for it it's not like i'm looking for it but i'm looking for it yeah usually to do signings the but in, the one in LA was probably the craziest dude I had like 12 security guards like crazy it was like overkill to be honest oh shit it cut off too early damn it new caught emote I would actually make this an emote I just don't know how but I'm down to make this an emote there's no answers needed hope you like it Tarak what in God's name is this Damn, I look good. Okay, insane ace first day CS2 major. Let's see. But they might just go straight through it. A little bit of an A. Kyla playing in front. Glaive burns alive, and now the lineup is ready. Oh. Kyla finds another headshot. He spins around, picks up the quad, and he's ready. The spray. And there's. That 
is so Wait, did his mouse fall off the table? Perfect from Kyler. Did he drop his mouse after the fact as well? This guy is nuts. That is a sequence and a half. Down, but they might just go straight. <laughs> Wu Hujin banning people that show he's boosted and he admitted to getting boost after condemning Tarek plus others so heavily for playing with friends. This motherfucker that was flaming me for boosting people when I wasn't got caught boosting? Fucking Banana Man was a fraud? This is a long ass post. I'm not reading it, but this guy should work for the FBI. Whoever wrote this post, you should be in the Federal Bureau of Investigation. Because this is just like, this is like, is this worth it? Is this worth it? I spell fraud wrong. Okay, so imagine you're at this epic gaming convention, right? And then bam, you see Tarek cosplaying Viper, but it's like a total train wreck. But like, even Though the cosplay is a hot mess, my heart is just melting because, duh, it's Tarek. Like, sometimes simping just defies all logic, turning even the cringiest cosplays into total heartthrobs. Also, ICL is like the new NGL, apparently. I'm just trying to be hip with the kids. I prefer NGL though, if I'm being honest. Gustav, I feel like I need a smile out of you. Maybe we need to shine your head or something? Sentinel's ready! Sentinels! Sentinels! Alright, kittens. Gustav, I feel like I need a smile out of you. Maybe we need to shine your head or something? <laughs> Sentinels ready! What the fuck is this? First map, sunset. Of course it's sunset. Sunset is map cringe. Shit. I'm tired of watching Mini the same boo, maps. That's what I'm saying. Yo, Tarek, did you ever play Poopy? Yesterday? Oh. Who? You. Who? Poopy? Who's Poopy? You. So no, no Poopy? No, I'm not Poopy. No, I didn't oh. Poopy. Oh, okay. Shameless. <laughs> Twice a day, bro. Morning and night. Thank you, Yasin. So 2-1 heretics or what? 2-0 two -oh heretics. Whoa. 2-0. Two -oh. two -oh. Whoa. Whoa. What? Paper X is just like, it's not giving. Paper X. That's the it's taking more than anything. Me. It's the right. comps, right? Wait, 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 yeah. wait. It is the comps. Two one paper off. Nobody has been spotted. They're anticipating it. I'll do it off cam. He can do in terms of continuing down that avenue. Hey, where's Jin? Jin G is super patient in a long avenue. Jin G and Big Boo and Lil Boo. Okay, that was weird. I didn't hear it actually. Damn! Yes. Not wanting to give away too much here. Completely understand that. Paper explain it closely. I got violated and is that it? Why? My nose? In their game, we saw the anger from Coach Alex. Is it bad? Out. Because let's be honest, that game was a bit of a mess, especially on map number three from this paper. I like it. Good W. They rock out That's W. With this composition with no sentinel. They're, they're Wait. leaving gaps. They're Bro, they have a blind. highlight of this We're guy raging. We're so many of these okay. mistakes. Cypher That's so PK, funny. I think. It's a mod compilation. <laughs> Don't know who that is. Too far away. T Fuck, my goat doesn't know me.
bro. Whatever. I don't even, whatever, bro. Whatever, bro. I don't even care no more. I'm just gonna watch the games and shut up. Run for its money. That's for sure. The reality is, you can understand why this is a coach that's so invested in in the success of this squad, considering the success that they've had in the past. But going through an identity change without Jing, we always knew this was gonna be a thing. Nobody on earth plays the game the way that Jing does. So you're all that fucking dog. That fucking dog. How dare he disrespect? Well, of course, it's in a talk about heretics. How dare he disrespect? This one. I think you know, as the players start to uh, make their way in, this is certainly going to be quite the challenge here for both squads. I really want to see if Paper X is going to just give us I'm something. Playing, I don't care. Just a little bit different coming. It's all good, bro. It's yeah, all good. Will, but I, I think at this point, it, it's not yes. going to be time to, to, to change comps a lot more. I don't even know him. I know quite him. Quite honestly, individual him. form on the day. I think we. I don't really know him, but I know of him. Out of him. Yet in this match, he, he's being put into.